Assalamualaikum and hi My name is Nol Janah Bintar Brazis And today my group member and I will present to you about Subtraction Okay uh, As we know uh, Image are produced when there is a contrast on the radiograph But when there is no contrast on the radiograph No difference in density on the radiograph There will be no image produced Okay so, as we perform the subtraction technique, it's purposely to make the contrast become zero. Shafiza and Amira will explain to you about on how to perform the subtraction technique in the radiography. But, generally, when there is a difference between two radiographs of the same part of the body, the difference can be actually revealed by covering one radiograph with a diapositive of the other which means by performing the subtraction technique we will be able to recognize the vessels that fill with contrast by first viewing Do you guys curious about the purpose of performing subtraction technique in the radiography? Well, actually subtraction technique is performed to eliminate all the unwanted images on the radiograph for example, in DCG procedure, we use separation technique to remove the nasal bone, facial bone, orbit bone and surrounding soft tissue to demonstrate the lacrimal duct with contrast. This is an example of image of lacrimal duct after perform subtraction technique. So, uh, to know more about the subtraction technique, we will move to next presenter which is Farah. Hi and Assalamualaikum. My name is Nur Farah Erdina binti Ahmad Kushairi. I will explain about the principle of subtraction based on the examination that you see the subtraction. Okay, I will explain the examination that you see the subtraction. So, I will give uh, two examples as I mentioned that using a subtraction. First is this and this. Okay, I will explain about the angiography. So, basically, there are many and several as I mentioned on the angiography that using a subtraction. But I will just point out two of it, which is first is a peripheral angiography and cardiac angiography. So, what is the purpose of the subtraction? Basically, uh, subtraction is used is used to remove the bone such as facial bone, uh, nasa bone, orbit, uh, and other than that to demonstrate the uh, vessel with a contrast medium clearly. Okay. Furthermore, for angiography examination, they also call as a digital subtraction angiography. Uh, basically, there are technique of a subtraction in the angiography, so I will just point out three of them, which is this, this, and this. That's all for the angiography. Okay, next, uh, I will explain about the dental digital subtraction. So, for a dental digital subtraction, the subtraction are normally made in a binary image. Mm -hmm. So, what is the process of the subtraction on this examination? So, for the process of the subtraction, the subtraction will reverse the sheets of gray uh, for a diagnostic purpose. Okay, I will explain about the examination of a uh, reverse sheets of gray on a dental digital subtraction. Okay, first, uh, for a radio lucid image on a dental digital image, it is normally appear black. But when the subtraction occur, it will reverse the shades of grey, it will turn into white. Get it? I will explain about the second example of a reverse shades of grey. Okay, for a radio pack, area that are along the teeth such as a good crown uh, normally appear white on radiograph but when a subtraction occur it will turn into a radio lucent or translucent okay that is the end of my explanation about the principle of subtraction thank you i will pass to Nur shafiza 
Hello, my name is Nusha Fisa Bintil Tiamin and I will present about method of performing photographic subtraction. Okay, so here we have uh, two Scott film which is film A, film B with contrast media, mask film, and the last one is film C. Okay, so first we need to take film A and mask film and put on the machine to expose. After the film A and mask film exposed on the machine, it will produce film C. The average gradient of mask film is 1 because it is easier to make the density turn to 0. After film A and mask film are exposed, it will produce film C, which is this. The film C is reversal from the film A in all that all the density in film C are reversal. So, that's all from me. Thank you. And I will pass the film to Amira. So, next, my name is Nur Amira Paila and I will explain about the next step. She is what we did is the print film. This print film contain 1.75 average gradient. It is a bit high from the mass film because we need to increase the contrast of the image. And next, we need the scalp film with the contrast medium. And then we need the film C. So what we need to do is to place uh, all of the film together and make sure it is completely superimposed to each other. And then place it on the duplicating machine. And then after we have exposed, and we process the film. As the result, we will obtain the subtraction film. So as you can see in here, the contrast medium is in dark in color because during we expose the film to the light, contrast medium is something that can easily penetrate. So that's why it's getting to the dark color while the other will be in a light color. So that's all. Thank you. Thank you.